guys. So I'm really, really, really excited for this video today because we are testing out some as seen on TV clothing and accessories. And if you guys haven't seen my face before, definitely make sure to click that red subscribe button. I do make videos twice a week on all sorts of fashion and fun stuff. So you guys should stick around and let's get started. I'm excited and I'm scared and I'm nervous. Ready? Oh, they just like shove it in there. Okay, we're gonna start with the first item. So it looks like this when it comes. I ordered like four items. So the first thing is literally just like placed on top, no packaging, no nothing. Okay, so this thing looks like this. Um, you're probably like, wait, Laura, that's the back of the shirt. No, this is the front. Okay, so this thing is called the posh tur, but like the posh tur, not, not supposed to be one word. I have horrible posture, so this is great. We are going to stick the posh tur on. Let's see what it does. This is what the back looks like. It just looks like a regular tank top. And then the front looks like this. I'm just gonna do this because like, I feel like keep it PG-13. Um, and the, it just kind of like goes around the bottom of my boob area there. I really don't think this is doing anything at all. Okay, so it's supposed to make your peer taller, pull your shoulders back, give your boobs an added lift, make tummy appear flatter. Why would it make your stomach appear flatter? This one's kind of hard to show on camera because obviously it's like more of a like a bra type thing. But in terms of everything else it claims to do, I do think it is kind of a flop because it doesn't help my posture at all. I honestly don't think it like lifts my boobs really either. Like maybe ever so slightly, maybe smooths out bulges in the back. Like if you're wearing a t-shirt um, and you usually get that with like a bra, but I don't know if I would waste your money on this. I, I don't think so. So I'm gonna give this a Okay, so next up we have the three-way poncho. And let me tell you, I have seen many infomercials of this in my late night editing sessions. I believe this does work. Maybe like not someone for our age necessarily. Maybe it's like your mom, but you know what? Let's not put an age on it. Let's try it out. So this is the three-way poncho by Suzanne Summers. So let's see what Suzanne has to say about her ponchos. The three-way poncho, Suzanne Summers style secret. Say that three times. As seen on TV is flattering, easy to fit garment that you'll wonder how you lived without it. Wear over leggings or jeans for the perfect casual look or pair it with a skirt or slacks for a professional look. All right, D from Texas said, I will wear this to work and at night on a date with jeans and heels off the shoulders, simple and chic. This person right here is pissed. Suzanne Summers ripoff. The fabric is thin, sleeves are too tight, and basically does not fit well. On first review of the package, it feels like a little... I don't know if I would have chosen this particular package, Suzanne. So this is kind of what it looks like. I feel like you're not going to get the full gist until like I actually try it on. So I just put on the three-way poncho. And I sure as heck hope this isn't supposed to be a dress. This does not seem appropriate. Okay, I'm looking up right now whether this is supposed to be... A dress because I'm pretty sure in this she wore this as a dress and I mean like I'm 5'8 but like it's really short okay wait maybe she's not wearing it as a dress but like in this photo she doesn't have pants on <laughs> what the heck how okay this woman's definitely wearing it as a dress but it's like so short okay I'm gonna show you what the dress looks like on me is it appropriate for you too probably not I definitely think I need to wear pants Suzanne what are you doing to us lady all right and then we have the sexy version for going out at night I'm not gonna lie I actually kind of like this look, I do think it looks kind of chic. Like this is cute. Looks like you've just like wrapped a drape over yourself and you're ready to party. But let's stick some pants on and try out the other styles. Okay, so this is what I'm looking at right now. <laughs> this is where she was just like chilling and doesn't have pants on. Oh, I guess she has it around her shoulders there. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, so around the shoulders, it can be worn as a dress. So let's try this kind of may rob your house look. So right now we have the off the shoulder, sexy, you've just gotten off work, ready for drinks with the girls kind of look, at least that's what they made it seem like in the infomercial. And then you're going on vacay, maybe a long flight. Um, I don't really understand how this is gonna be it. <gasps> what? I'm this doesn't look good. I don't get it. I mean, okay, so maybe like a off the head, like halfway, but then it's like, if I want to make it a full hood, like she kind of envisioned it, it's like I feel like the hunchback in Notre Dame, but all I'm missing is just like the hump. Okay, so then the next look that we're gonna go for is this look right here. Ta-da! I guess you're supposed to put it, because I feel like it's like a little bit, like if you were to wear it like down here and wear that to work, like I don't, that's a lot of little chest show and so this look personally i'm not digging i do kind of like the off the shoulder one like i can definitely get behind that one we're gonna get someone else's opinion of what they think of the three-way poncho 
Who would have thought Laura Reed threw a poncho lover? Okay guys, so I arrived at Christian's and we're gonna see what he thinks of my three away poncho. It's late and I'm outside, so I need to try to be quiet, but. What do you think of my three way poncho? So this is just one way. What? I This is my new shirt. Did you make it? It's a, no, Christian, it's a three way poncho and I bought it from AstinonTV.com. And this is one way, so this is an off the shoulder look. Okay, I like that. And um, I'm gonna show you the other looks. I'm gonna come inside. Okay, so yay, this is Christian, by the way. This is my boyfriend. Who are you introducing me to? And, cause you're gonna be my video. Ever since you bought that punch. <laughs> Wait, what are you talking about? I was like, why, why are you introducing me? Well, just if like there's new viewers who haven't seen you before. Anyways. You have new viewers now that you have a new poncho? <laughs> yeah. So this is the first look and it's supposed to just be me at work kind of thing. Okay. And it I looks like it. Yeah, it's kind of like reminds me of Pam. <laughs> in the office. Okay. So this is like you've left work now and you're going out to Ooh. party. So it's like an off the shoulder look. Yeah. And then this looks supposed to be worn with no pants. So like a <laughs> stripper look. <laughs> no, it's like a dress. You wouldn't wear pants? No, the, the lady didn't have pants on. Okay, I think close your eyes for the last look. You know, but seriously, don't open that. I want it to be a surprise, okay? Just don't open your eyes. And then you're gonna let me know which look you like best. Okay, don't. <sighs> Okay, open your eyes. This is legit the last look. You look like a Dementor. <laughs> From Harry Potter. I, I don't get this last look. Do you want to try it on? Do I have to? Yeah, come on. Great news, guys. I've convinced him to try on the three-way poncho. So this is not only females, it's also male. Anybody can wear it. We're not going to limit it. Oh. We were in six ways. <laughs> they just didn't advertise this one. <laughs> Use it as a leash. So what do you, what do you think of that look? Mom, don't talk to me. It's my <laughs> moody teen face. Okay, what do you think of that look, though? I would not wear this. This is for women. <laughs> you can try the off-the-shoulder one. Don't take it off yet. You can try the, You didn't do the off, fully off-the-shoulder one. <laughs> oh, okay, try the hood one now. You didn't try all of them. Oh, that totally works. Do they advertise it for men? Uh, no. <laughs> Kanye. <laughs> I mean, I would give this... I could totally see an Aussie wearing this. Sorry if you're Aussie. Um, wow, okay, so I would give this like a thumbs up for both for men versatility. and women. Versatility, really, because I could wear it, we could share it. It probably comes in different colors too. It's okay, you can have it. Thanks. So this next thing, which I am excited to try, this is called the Simply Contour, and the Simply Contour is the unique garment that flatters your abdomen, slims your waist, lifts and shapes your butt, hallelujah, giving you all the right curves in all the right places. That's Try this on and see how it goes. But before I try this on, I've decided I'm going to get really, really, really bloated. Um, so then we can see if it actually works its magic. Because one thing you should know about me is I get bloated very easily. I'll have like a few cups of water and it looks like I'm about to give birth in three months. Okay, so I decided to put on a skirt that was basically like you can see everything going on here. But first I'm gonna drink like three or four glasses of water to get myself really bloated because I bloat very, very easily getting really, really bloated. Okay, I'm just taking a little break because I'm like, it almost hurts now to drink water. Like I've just drank it so quick. Okay, so this is proving to be a little. All right, you guys ready to see what I just did to myself? Okay, so we're back with the bloated stomach. From the front, you cannot see it, but from the side, are you ready? Are you ready? So this is me, just like normal, whatever. This is me trying to look cute and then fully relaxed. Are you ready for this? So. Like this, this doesn't look cute. Here we have it. Oh my gosh, guys, it comes in two colors. All right, let's do the, okay, we're gonna go for the nude one because I'm wearing a white skirt. Oh, 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 it even has these little things that your butt like kind of fit into. So I'm excited to put this on and see if this actually fixes the bloating and makes my butt look nice and perky. This is like impossible to get over your butt. Ow, this like, it hurts. You just gotta like wiggle into it. I wish I could show you guys like what my butt looks like in this. That'd be weird. I have the shorts on. It was not an easy task, I'll tell you that much. Um, I feel like it's honestly not doing that much for my bloating. I feel like you can definitely still see like a lot of bloating going on. Um, I mean, okay. Let's like put the skirt down and see 
what we have. You can totally see like the two circles of like where it's lifting your butt up. I can't deal with this right now. That's so funny. Oh my gosh, like look. It looks like I have butt pads on. We're gonna rule out the white skirt because this definitely, definitely doesn't work with something that's like a thin see-through fabric. So anything bright, it literally looks like I have butt pads on. That's so funny. So I'm currently trying it on with a dress that I normally cannot wear if I'm bloated at all. Um, and it actually looks like pretty decent. The only problem though is if it like, you can kind of see the lines of the actual thing if you bend a little bit. If it's not skin tight, you can't really see the circles, which is obviously good. I do think if you did have some like unwanted bulge, like maybe in your stomach or like love handles that you did want to get rid of, it definitely would do a good job, but not as good of a job as it makes it seem on here. I don't know. It's just like the difference between this and this is just, I don't think that's actually happening. But like this, I definitely think could be true. So you know what? I definitely don't give this a flop because I don't think it's a flop at all, um, but I don't give it a 10 stars because it's not really doing what it's showing that it's gonna do by basically giving you like a giant Brazilian butt lift, um, but in shape or form. So for that reason, I'm gonna give it a half of them. Also, this would actually work really well wearing it under jeans because obviously then you can see the little circles. So that would actually work out pretty good. Okay, so I stuck on a pair of jeans quickly and it actually looks like pretty decent. Um, it kind of just looks like you're wearing underwear a little bit because it does have that line, but you know what? It's not too bad. So there we go. For the people who maybe need a little bit of a boost, this thing could be for you. Okay. Okay, so next up we have something that is not only fashionable, but it is practical for driving at night. You probably have no idea what I'm trying to explain, but I'm gonna tell you, um, where are my scissors? So this is an item I was originally drawn to because I've actually seen girls wear these glasses, um, but apparently the purpose is not supposed to be fashion. It's supposed to be function. I feel like I'm working for an infomercial right now. I have to admit though, these past two nights I have been staying up kind of late and late enough for the infomercials to come on, which at that point, you know, you should probably go to bed. But I kind of like, in a weird way, enjoy watching infomercials. I just find it like, just kind of funny to see, um, especially <laughs> the before you have the product and then the after and people are like being dramatic and fumbling like the actors. I just get great amusement of that. Let me know if you guys feel the same. Okay, so these bad boys are the Night View Envy Glasses cut down the glare. I think that's like their slogan. Um, okay, so these turn fuzzy and dull into clear and bright, especially at night. I can wear them during the day too, nice. I also wanted to pull up some of the reviews just to get uh, people's input. So 97% of respondents would recommend this to a friend. Jim gives them five stars and he says, these glasses are great if you get caught in a heavy rainstorm while driving. They increase your field of vision threefold. While driving from Kentucky to Atlanta, we came into a very heavy, Rainstorm in Knoxville. Okay, wow, well, he's, he's really going to some description here. Uh, his wife said that she could hardly see the car directly in front of her. And with these glasses, I could see a quarter mile ahead of me. What? Well, and then he put in big letters, bottom line, yes, I would recommend this to a friend. <laughs> Someone said, good lenses, lousy frames. Honestly disappointing. We're gonna do a little night driving test as well, but I am gonna head outside during the day right now so we can also do a day test because you know what, you really guys, if you're gonna get these, you need the full experience from me first, so let's go. Okay, yeah, this is honestly not as cute as I was <laughs> as I was envisioning because I often see like girls on Instagram like wearing these types of glasses. Do you see this? No, I look like a creeper in the night. This is not, <laughs> this is not good. Let's do this. I don't really know if they're, actually doing anything let's go outside and take a look weird because like i can't tell on the camera if it's like the right lighting settings okay this gives me like a everything's like a dull a dull fade of yellow <laughs> so um hmm but i'm really interested to try them at night and see what it's actually gonna be like all right guys so i have taken myself to the road for the love of this video and i have the glasses right here so we are gonna put those babies on all right let's go makes the street lights like even more distracting like normally i don't find street lights distracting i've never had this much fun night driving in my whole life this is making it much much worse is creating like a little rainbow almost in the uh in the headlights when they come straight and all of the street lights look like they're like triple lights if anything this is like distracted driving don't tell my mom x a that these unfortunately i don't know if this is like something wrong with my glasses, but it's almost like these are like kaleidoscope glasses. That's what it's kind of, I guess, the best way to describe it. 
Can you see that? What do you think these are? Glasses. But what would their purpose be? See, do they gradually, like a filter that makes things yellow? <laughs> Basically, but it's supposed to help with it's like that sepia tone. On so it's Instagram. it's supposed. Oh, to, it's the Christian, doing things with the lights. No, but what it's supposed to do is for night driving. <laughs> really? It's supposed to wear at night. I wore it on the way over here, and it, like it was like kaleidoscope glasses. It's not good. All right, guys. So that is it for the video. I really hope that you guys enjoyed watching it and got a little bit of a chuckle out of it because I did have a lot of fun making this. And if you guys want to see more videos like this where I buy interesting products off random websites let me know in the comment section below and i hope you guys have a wonderful rest of your day and i'll see you guys in my next video bye